Hello and welcome back to Skyrim Special Edition on the PlayStation 4. Uh, after clearing the cave that we cleared, we returned to Thal Creek and followed her instructions of east out, uh, north of the fork, and then we get to Pine Watch, which is this building right here, and then she said take a left. So I take that to mean cut through this woods here. So we've got a little break into the rockiness, and I think if you just take this left, you'll go straight out, and you may see a little plot of land, and this is definitely the place, and now we're going to be doing some construction. So, this is not completely new to me. Okay, I have... Let's see. This one. So you do that, and then what? How do we do this? Carbon to the workbench? Alright. So now you need all this stuff. So we need nails and stone. And I'm gonna need iron for the nails, I'm sure. Wait, it's the building materials, and then you see nails right here. So we need iron for that. So we need iron, and we need quarried stone. Now, luckily, we've got this right here. So we can immediately get stone we need. That's four. This goes infinite. Doesn't just do the three. Yeah, that goes infinitely. Now, what we have here, this is clay, yeah. which we're also going to need. And we also need lumber. So, we're going to head to the mill to order some lumber, and then we'll go back into Foul Creek to get some iron. But what I'm thinking about right now is the fact that you have to build the, like a small house here. You have to build this before you can build a larger house. And that simply makes no sense at all to me. Like, you should just plan out the house you want and build that. Like, there's no reason to do it in stages like this. But, it's okay. And then we will... We'll do what the game asks of us. I've been hunting and... Take a look. And just as an aside here. Until next time. I was looking at the trophy requirements. Which I mentioned in the last video, I couldn't quite remember what they were. Bruce, All I need to do for this first house is put three wings on it. So that's not going to be nearly as uh, specific as I thought it had to be. I thought they were telling me, you know, you have to have an alchemy wing, you have to have this wing. You know, build an enchanter wing on the north side. Like, I thought they were going to be picky about the way that you build your house, but it was not that way. I did not remember it correctly at all. I know in uh, Riverwood you can use this. Yourself. But there was never a point to going. And I wonder now. If 
you do this yourself? Do you get the logs for free? Or is there still no problem? I don't know if I don't know if I don't know if I don't know if I Pointed me in here. There's nobody in here. They point me out there. There's nobody out there. Is this? Is Foul Creek? Is the entire region of Foul Creek just broken? Because that's what it's looking like to me. There's one. Finally, there's a person. I hope that's one of them. Here for work. Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. Yeah, sure, but uh, <laughs> I would like to buy some lumber. Doing some building, eh? We can deliver it wherever you need. I can't just give away good timber. Doing some building, eh? I'll have them hold over right away. Doing some building, eh? I'll have them hold over right away. Alright, we'll get 40 for now. I feel like... It's not going to be enough. But... It's a place to start. So Hurt wants firewood, and I think that does count as assisting the residents of Bell Creek, so if I can find an axe, I'll do it right now, but it does not look like there's one here, and I mentioned this at one point, that the last time I chopped wood, I left the axe where I found it, and the next time I need it, I would probably not be able to find one. And it appears like that is exactly what's happening. So, good on me for recognizing problems before they arise. Steel's good. Take a look. How about you give me? Do you just sell straight nails? No, of course not. Too much like me. Let's give me a lunch. See me okay. at my forge if you need arms or armor. By the by, <laughs> I probably should have said this a little bit earlier. Uh, this episode is, is going to be all of this. I mean, there's no... There's not going to be any adventuring in this episode. So, if this house building is dull to you, then we. I mean, honestly, this is, this is, you know, there's so much. There's no reason to stay here. No reason.
I know it's... For me, anyway, it, it's kind of a tough moment to say, you know, I don't mean to watch this, but... It's been better, trust me. I remember very specifically a time when I was watching somebody who I was very loyal to, and I watched them. I watched them. Oh, I think it was. No, not, not more or less, just I watched everything they did. Because I, I like the person. And so their content was always enjoyable to me. Just because they were featured in it. And you know, there was a time you know, I had to face that yeah, I'm not enjoying this particular video and I'm I'm going to just walk away with this. And it's okay. You can you can absolutely do that and you will recover. Who's Trust me. Whoop, not there. No, no, no. Not iron. Stop. The progress does happen as it is. So maybe, maybe it's best to do one piece. Okay. And now you can see that we got the wall up. House is coming together. Okay. Roof up, the thing. Now we need ten more nails and some stone. And it's the drafting table doesn't do anything right now. So we'll let me get this quarry up. Get the quarry up. Iron fitting, look at this. Iron fittings, lock, and two hinges. So this is where it gets a little complicated. Okay. So we need iron fittings, right there. Two hinges, right there. And then we need corundium ingot to do the lock. And that's not something I want to say, but as you see now, we do have protection from the weather. So this is coming together pretty nicely. So now we need to go get some crimson ingots. And I wish right now that I had carried some stuff with me. I dropped off a lot of things uh, when I was selling between videos. And this is a by the by as well. I did I finished up Wind and Stone in the off time between videos, and I was trying to think of a way to really explain, you know, she, she sailed back to Solstein to hand the guy the book, and yeah, she did, but the facts here are, there's a lot of things she doesn't do on video, you know, every time I sell, you know, I'm not going to make you people watch with the video. The selling still happened, for sure. But I'm not going to have you guys watch through it. You know, we don't need to document every action she takes. And so that's why... That's why I think it's okay that she went back to White Run. Her soul soul. War is not new to Falkreath. We have only to stand in our cemetery.
citizen. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. This is a local favorite and one of the first songs I ever learned. Well met. Unlike my... I was once, but not anymore. Now maybe I don't pick up a blade in Ulfric's name no more, but I still hold with his ideals. We don't need no help from the Empire on that count. Steal anything from my Hello again, friend. I'll never forget what you did for me. Indara and I like to keep to ourselves and run our farm. Good to talk to you. At some point, we should not as dumb as you look. If she could get the Valkyrie was once full of Need something? Sure. What can I do for you? Better days. Sure. My voice could use a rest. You're going to have the men around here. A strong drink will chase off that chill in the air. I escaped fighting in Cyrodiil, only to have it track me down again in Skyrim. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. You hear any juicy gossip in town? Be sure to share it with me. Big night's sleep after building all day. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Welcome to Dead Man's Drink. People say there's someone in Riften that can change your face. Make you look completely different. Do you know. believe that? And this, you look at the time, it's, it's 5 a.m. You know, she got her eight hours, so that's really all she gets uh, any time. So now she just needs to kill three hours. So she, I escaped she's fighting in Cyrodiil, only to have it track me down again in Skyrim. Talking about market, we're not gonna do that. You hear any juicy gossip in town? Be sure to share it with You're me. going to have the men around here wrapped around your finger in no time. Good to talk to you. Falkreath was once full of... ...wanderers and warriors Keep like yourself. yourself. Those were better days. I suppose they were. Very nice. For me? Right. Hey, but steel's good, but take a look. That's what I need. I guess just the one for now. I don't know how many of these I'm actually gonna need, so we'll just take the one for now. I consider the iron. See me at my forge if you need armor. armor. Now the trip back up. As I think more about this, if she didn't have a house, if Leronway was, you know, spending every night in an inn, and she didn't have a house, maybe it does make sense for her to build a shelter, pretty much. It's a shed to sleep in. To build that straight away, and then just uh, build on from there. Just do additions to that basic structure. That makes some sense. But she has, you know, she has a house. In White Run, she has a house. And still time, you know, she's doing just fine. As far as places to live, yeah. And that's actually a little bit interesting, I think. If you look at where Lakeview Manor is situated, would she walk back to Falkreath and stay at an inn? Or would she walk to Whiterun and stay at her own house? That's a little bit of an interesting question that I think we should address tomorrow. Or tonight. In combat, huh? Another crab walking its way up here. That's what I'm going to get. Oh, just that. oh, a deer. Oh, well, there is a crab there. That was a deer I killed. And on my way here the first time, 
An elk was hostile towards me. I was just standing on the road getting ready to start the video and he started attacking me out of nowhere. It's interesting. Oh, there's iron right there. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. If I had a smelter. Oh, I think I can make one though. I don't have a lock? Oh, let it, yeah, I gotta make the lock. Okay, lock added. There you go. Now, at this point, we can start doing this stuff. We can make a smelter here. We'll need a lot more iron to do that. Um, hold up. We need... <laughs> if I had the smelter, we would have enough iron. That's pretty, that's pretty cute. But right now, yeah, I don't really think we need any of this stuff at the moment. So, you know, we can see... Oh, shit, I forgot! Yeah, adding the door makes it a new place. Yep, completely forgot about that. And what you can actually do here, now you have a workbench inside. And you can build yourself just barrels and beds and all kinds of good stuff. Should you want to. Firepack might not be a bad thing to do. And we need the goat horns for that. I, that is something I'm going to want to do, but we're going to have to get goat horns for it. Uh, but the double bed is the big thing right now. So we need nails, leather strips, and straw. Ugh. I'm not going to be able to keep track of all this stuff. So let's hit this drafting table first and see, you know, so we can remove the workbench from the inside of the house. That's fine. This is where we start doing additions. So let's go ahead and create this main hall. Let's get that started and let's see what we can do with this. You know. Another lock. Alright, we are back. Uh, we're heading to Alver this time because uh, he might have iron. We're, we're gonna need iron very soon. We, we actually need it already if we want the smelter, which we do. So, so we're gonna head to Alvar right now. Oh, it's his iron. Hey, buddy. Oops. Fuck yourself. Oh, man. Now, the smallest question I have right now is how much we care about doing this because that mine right there where that guy was standing guard there's a lot of iron in that mine so if we want we could go in there and mine a lot of iron and that may be something I, I think right now we're gonna buy out old Alvor here, and then we'll go back and get the two ores that the other bro has. But after that point, did you hear something? Hell, you can't hide from me. I think they're hostile for the wolves right now. I assume that's what they're angry at. I'm not worried about it. We go inside the Riverwood Trader first. Hey, but. Thank you. 
Some may call this junk. Me, I call Let them treasures. Let me see all the junk you have. Okay. So, what do I need? I'll take all your glass, all your goat horns. I kind of want these, too. Uh, we'll, we'll talk about that in a minute. All right, there's all the straw things. Okay. So let's see what I have to sell. Yep, now it's bow for sure. Apparel, I don't have any of that. We keep all my poisons for now. Take these. Take that. Could take that. And that. Oh, oh, we got jewels as well. Let's just give him the sapphire, and then we'll sell this ruby to power. Till next time. There. Hey, but you looking for an, looking to protect yourself or deal some damage? I'm actually looking to build a house. Give me all seven of these, all of those, this stuff, all these strips. I think that'll be all. Good day. Uh, we're getting. We're gonna run out of salt wood too. Pretty certain about that. But hopefully that'll leave us a little bit. Okay. I think we're gonna make this smelter first. Who's? Said. I think what we'll end up doing. Wish there was a pickaxe uh, here. That would be. Yeah, I meant. Oh, there it is. I can't have it. It's here, but I can't have it. So, ah, there we go. Thanks. Alright, so we'll just go ahead and take a little chop here. Alright. Now when we go back to her and get some of those, and that should count for one of the helping the people of Valkyrie requirements. What is that? Oh, off the shrine, yeah, we know her. We never did explore that. Ooh, look at this. Here's the mic. Oh no, that's mercenary. There's been word of some trouble nearby. I probably shouldn't tell everyone who asked. If you really want to do my job for... Just make sure you take care of whatever's going on there. It's my name on the line. So I like that. I appreciate that they... allow you to take over that thing. But... What I don't like is that they don't say what that is. They're just like, okay, there's trouble nearby. But, like, where? You know, <laughs> where was she going? I, I have no idea. Yeah, it just says map marker. It doesn't say anything really valuable to me. So, that frustrates me a bit. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is mine out this iron. There's actually two here. Which is great. That's a 
happy and making ourselves look better. So I have to do that right away. If it come on. Ah oh, shit. There. Uh, yeah, there we are. So double bed. He nails for it. God. This, this is fine, really. Okay, so here we can do hinges, fittings, lock, and nails. We know we need it all. And since we're here, we might as well just throw this ultra. Nope, we need another iron fittings and stuff. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Um, another Things. Okay, we need a crack of stone. And, 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 and we need enough stone. And then uh, we need two cracks of clay for that smelter. place to sleep. And now, we can walk over here. I do want to create a smelter. Turn over right here. New smelter right there. Uh, anyway, uh, iron. All into ingots. Alright, we're good. Now, that that's all out of the way, we need one more iron fittings for the door. So now, right there. Right, so now we've got that main door, and that is on the back side here. So. And we build up this whole what is essentially just going to be a bigger house. And we build that hall up, then we're you know, we can get from there and straight in. I'm hopeful that there will be a back door as well. Just go right into the main hall. Don't know for sure, but that's what I'm hoping is going to be the end result here. And we're gonna go ahead and grab some more stone, because I think we need some foundation. We'll do two cracks of stone. And that should be it, I think. And uh, I want to pop the timer here just to see how we're doing. We've got about 25 minutes. Oh, no, I need. Wow. 30 minutes. Alright, so. One. Two. Four. Five. Perfect. Back to the workbench. There we go. Now we need six for that and we need two pops of nails for the wall frame. Okay. Pop on the nails. I'm sorry if, if showing my work gets a little boring, but I, I think it's neat. I think it's neat. 
Like I said, I've actually built built houses in real life, so it's kind of it's really very satisfying to see the steps of progress. This foundation and then the later floor. It's, it's a nice it's nice to see the stages getting done. So we're we'll cracking the floor, cracking the wall, framing. Two cracks of clay, two cracks of nails right now. Nice four beams off, four laid down. We didn't take care of the weeds, which is a little bit of a concern if you're me, but whatever. Gotta take a couple cracks of clay here. And then I head back and take a couple of cracks of nails as well. And we two. Oh, and I. Get the walls up, get those supports up. Go ahead and put the frame in. And now we need, oh, we need more salt, we need more logs. And two cracks of clay and some more nails as well. So we'll just admire this for right now. It's pretty nice. But we are going to head back to the mill right now because we need more. I feel. Bruce! Bruce! I did not hurt him at all. Relatively comfortable saying that I don't know if I will not be pleased. But that's what we're going to buy over there, of course. Someone do something! I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. So the, the, that was the same hunter I talked to that was riding that horse. What happened to his horse? I feel like we missed a little bit of a story there. Something came along and killed his fucking horse. Oh. Bruce? Hello. Here for work? Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. Honest gold for honest work. Perfect. Doing right. some building, eh? We can deliver it wherever you need. I'll have them hold over right away. Doing some building, One, eh? I'll have two. them hold over right away. Doing some building, eh? I'll have them hold over right away. Doing okay. some building, eh? Do? I'll have them hold over right away. Thanks. I feel like... I wish I had thought of this a moment sooner. But I really feel like uh, the last time I built a house... I think this is probably the second time going full into it. Like, I think I started... When I first got the DLC, like, I made, like, the full thing. Like, I, I did the entire building. As long as they left me build, you know, I would build it. Simple as that. <clears throat> but then the second time, like I, I put up the walls maybe, and then I said, well, you know what? Bruce?
so this is really my second time going deep into this. And I feel like the first time I went deep into it, I ended up buying way too much lumber. And so I just had a lot of excess lumber hanging around my place. But, I mean, it's fine. It's, it's relatively cheap. So it's not like I'm wasting any lumber. I find a lot of iron around the place, which is great. Could it be? Looks like it could be. Hey, there you are, you drunken bastard. I did it, so pay up. Who? We caroused together with Sam Guaven, remember? We broke into the Temple of Debella. How much did you end up drinking? You and Sam dared me to go into that bandit camp? Well, I did, and brought back his stupid hat like you said. So give me the 10,000 gold you promised. I don't remember any of that. Well, all right. Just because we're friends. Give me, say, 750 gold, and we can call it even. I'm not gonna give you anything. Are you kidding me? I fought off all those bad. If there's one thing I never should have come here. You being serious right now. Fools! Because I don't want to be serious with you. I think I'm gonna give that guy 750. Just give me the fucking hat, man. I said that this is kind of nothing to me, so maybe I should have settled. Has he lost me? Guess. Right. Fuck me. Okay, I'm curious even if he had like a silly hat or something. <laughs> Actually, only 12. So, nine, so 36 actual hits. There's 12 already if there's a winner. 15. Yeah. 
and 36. We've made ourselves a salad. Alright, that's the main hall completely done. Well, I'm actually going to take this book, by the way. And there's our beautiful main hall. And it does look like they didn't let me have a back door. Which is a little bit of a shame, because I would have to have had one. But it's okay, because I still think it's going to be just a single loading screen here, and then this just happens to be the door. You know, no huge inconvenience to go through that door. This is, I think, now maybe I'm a little bit unsure of exactly how I want to do this, but I'm, I'm thinking this is, because look, there's these two different things here. And I'm thinking, you know, two different things here. That this is all you can have. So you're, the idea is you want to build everything here. At least that's my understanding of how this works. Uh, we'll, we'll work us on. We'll, <laughs> we'll work us. We will work on interior design at a later time. So this is a different bench. And so now you're looking. At items as well. So, yeah, I think each bent is something else in the best seller as well, which we will not even begin to look at. So, let's head inside. Yeah, I mean, as far as, yeah, interior decorating, I'm thinking I may just go the route. I'm either going to do absolutely nothing with it, and just have it be a place to sleep, or I'm going to go the full distance with it and just fill every single thing they've got. I mean, that's that's the two ways I can see this going. Okay, so this is where decisions come into play. The first sort of thing, see, if we want a trophy room. Does that mean get rid of the main hall? I guess so. I, I guess that's what that one means. But, like, look, the, the greenhouse can only be a less wing. So I feel like, and then, but also, like, the enchanter tower can only be a less wing. So that's kind of how I, I see this. Like, we, we want to do the enchanter's tower, you know, and then do we do trophy room? I don't think we do another tower. Like, I don't think we put towers on each side. So then it kind of has to be the armory on the east wing. So yes, armory on the east wing, and then the west wing is going to be Enchanter's Tower, I believe. Even though... Like, we're not going to plant anything. Maybe bedrooms. Because, you know, do we want this town? We probably want town. We? I mean, we're not going to really be enchanting anything. That's the reason I'm using this tower right now. But it's, it's fine. I, I think I want a tower. Storage room or trophy room. Oh, I can only do one at a time. I didn't realize. Okay. So, armory. Well, armory is a definite. So let's do. Yeah, let's do these two armory for right now. Okay. So, three locks, six hinges, and three fittings. Three locks. 
six inches. One, two, three. Three. Two, three. Hope that's enough for the armory doors. It is. Alright, alright. And now we need ten this time. But yeah, now we're going to go over here to the east side. This is the west side. East side, right here. You get these stairs. So this is gonna be a two-story. It's gonna be a deck, I think, up there. So kind of, kind of strange. To get I guess just to keep it even. You get you get six plots long. The main hall is. So yeah, just to keep it even, you would do that. That's probably exactly how I would build it. Like if this were say Minecraft and I was building a house like this, and my main hall happened to be uh, divisible by six. In that way, then I would do, you know, four doors, or two double doors. All right, that should be all the stone I need for the foundation. There we go. And now we need one more hit to the floor, and then we need to build a nail as well. So let's go pop that nail. What's up? Alright, we need two stone for that, two stone for that. So just one hit of stone should give me both of those, which is good. Let's see, we got the wall supports up. And then we're looking at one, two. There's your hit of stone. Now you're looking at. I feel like that's not right. No, we need. Yeah, well, let's get another hit of stone. I, I miss. I misunderstood. Because each one was saying we needed two stones, but that's because we had two stones. So we needed a total of eight, but we actually only had two. So, hit that floor, hit that roof. Now we need to hit a clay for the walls. But again, we're doing alright, we're getting shit up. Get some nice progress on this armory. I just had a thought as I was digging that clay out. There are oh the armor is done. Right there's your armor. So but there are three uh, buildings. I, I didn't actually realize this. This is something I never knew. But yeah, Dawnstar and uh starts with an M. Markarth? No, Markarth is the one way. Morthal. Morthal. And Dawnstar. These both have plots you can buy. So that leads to three total buildings you can build. And what I'm thinking about right now is you know, let, let's make it so that we have all nine wings. So this will be the only building I have with an armory. That's what I'm thinking. And so do I want. I probably put a single tower on each building, so with that in mind, let's go ahead and make the Enchanter's Tank Tower. Next. Get low on iron though. I think that's going to be an, an obstacle. <clears throat> three locks, six hinges. He's got those two ores. When we get them from him, he can make the doors. But then we're going to be out of iron the rest of the event.
up there. Probably made our way around the mountain, but it's be too little too late. Ugh. Three minutes. Two more iron fitting, right? Is that what it was? Was it an iron fitting that we were in need of? Yeah. That'll give us the doors, but obviously there's going to be a lot more that we need. So let me check the timer here, because I think we're. Yeah, we've got about two minutes left, so. Next time we'll be heading back to Embershard Mine because we are in need of iron. So that is that. <laughs> There's the timer. Um, uh, we, we we're not gonna head it at night. We're gonna go to sleep. We're gonna rest because we spent all day building. So, I head inside our home and we're going to fall asleep and I will see you guys on the next one.